Intelligent agents monitor students to find activity that matches criteria that you set. The criteria that the agents search for are login activity, course activity, release conditions in the learning environment. Some examples would be emailing users with grades below a certain level on individual assignments, checking for users that have logged, logged in within a specific number of days, and checking for users that view a specific content topic. So in this particular tutorial, we're going to set up an agent for students that have not logged in in a certain number of days, specifically to the course. To get to the intelligent agents, you click on the edit course on the nav bar. You click on intelligent agents. You click the new button and you give the agent a name. The description is optional. Make sure you check box agent is enabled to make sure that agent will run. And then what you want to do in this particular case is under the course activity click the check box next to take this activity when the course activity criteria are satisfied. By default the radio button is chosen users has have not accessed the course for at least in this case I'm going to say five days so when this agent runs it will look for students that haven't accessed the course in five days and if they meet that criteria then they will get uh, an email the next thing you need to do is to checkbox use schedule if you don't use the schedule uh, then the agent doesn't run automatically you must you will have to run it manually I'm going to click on update schedule you're going to choose how often it repeats daily weekly monthly or annually I'm going to choose daily I'm going to choose repeats one day and I'm what I'm going to do to make this run just on one day is I'm going to choose to let it run on one day and then have an end date on that day so that leads it runs just that one day but if you want it to run for the whole week you then choose has a start date and end date and then put that in there. Click on the update button and you'll see that this is going to be scheduled every day starting on the 23rd until the 23rd and next run is at December 23rd in this particular case. You should know that the agent uh, run, will run at about 8 p.m. every night. So the next thing you need to do is set up the email. In the to box you want to put in um, this specific what's called a replace string which is called initiating user and have the brackets into it. What that means is that will replace each student's email address that meets the agent's criteria. You can type in the subject and then you can type in a message. Of course you may want to make it a little bit more important than that and then click on save and close. So again scheduled agents run about 8 p.m. at night. You'll know the agent is run because you'll get an email from the My Courses system or you could come back to the intelligent agent list and look under the last run date and it'll be there. If I go up to the email tool you'll see that I that what the email will look like is this. It will come from no reply and it will say that the following agent has finished running. Now you don't know which students meet that criteria and which don't. So the you would one of the ways you could know that is by going through the intelligent agent here. And in the BCC put your name. But to be honest, that means you'll get an email for every single student. So I wouldn't do that. I just rely on the system uh, to know that it has run.